Welcome. This is a video about one of the test groups from the Billiard Skills Competition Training Program. Each test is a set of table layouts with a scoring system, that helps track your current and future abilities. This is the Cue Ball Path Test Group, Set 1, from the book. These tests are at the intermediate level. There are three layouts in this test. The book is a series of standardized tests, to verify your playing abilities. These tests help identify your strong and weak playing skills. There are tests for pocketing, cue ball control, runouts, positioning, and more. For the ball positions, you need these donuts. Put one for each ball position in the table layout. You can then set up the exact same situation every time. As a set of practice problems, work on these shots until they become routine. Each set of tests will improve your competitive skills. Here are the rules to take this test. Rule 1. Set up the donuts for the cue ball and object ball. Rule 2. Put down donuts for each side of the target path. Rule 3. Shoot each layout, 10 times. Rule 4. Score 1 point for each time you successfully run the cue ball, through the target path. This is the cue ball path test group, set 1, layout 1, for intermediate level players. The purpose, is to pocket the object ball and get the cue ball to roll into the target path, shown on the layout. Experiment with various top spins on the cue ball. Using the clock system, try a range of spins from 12 o'clock, 12.30, 1 o'clock, 1.30, and so on. Please note. Try this with various speeds, from soft 2 up through medium 3. The angle out will change, based on the cue ball speed. Your experimentation, with various speeds and spins, will improve your knowledge which you can use in competitions. Count your points after you complete the 10 shots for this layout. This is the cue ball path test group, set 1, layout 2, for intermediate level players. On this layout, you must pocket the object ball and pull the cue ball back, so the path is on the left side of the table. To make this work, the cue ball has to have some left spin coming off the shore trail. Using the clock system, try a range of spins, from 12 o'clock, 11.30, 11 o'clock, 10.30, and so on. Please note, if using this as an exercise, besides the various spins you apply to the cue ball, you can also use different speeds. Based on where and how far the cue ball needs to go, your experimentation will provide knowledge, that can be applied during competitive matches. Count your points after you complete the 10 shots for this layout. This is the cue ball path test group, set 1, layout 3, for intermediate level players. As with the other two layouts, you need to pocket the object ball into the corner. Then, you must send the cue ball up table through the middle area. To get the ball to roll along this path, try the various top spins. Using the clock system, experiment with 11 o'clock, 11.30, 12, 12.30, etc. Please note, when using this as an exercise, you want to try this with various cue ball speeds. You will need to know what happens and the various paths. The knowledge will be important when similar situations arise during competitions. Count your points after you complete the 10 shots for this layout. Scoring your test. Add up your points. Here is how to evaluate your total test results. For 26 to 30 points. This is outstanding. You are a serious and tough competitor. In the book. Do the advanced level for this test group. For 18 to 25 points. You have good skills. You do need to put in some practice time, to improve your cue ball maneuvering. Then, retake the test and see the improvements. For less than 18 points, you really need to put in some significant practice time, and learn to play these shots. 
otherwise, you are going to lose more games than you should. All the tests from the book have four purposes. Measure your skills. These tests identify your current playing skills with actual results. You get a realistic opportunity to measure the reality of your actual shooting skills. Self-knowledge. The tests strip away fuzzy personal assumptions. This helps you make more intelligent table decisions. Personal training program. Individual test shots with low scores indicate what areas you need to improve. Repeated self-testing demonstrates the success of your practice results. Competitive skills comparison. You can use tests from the book to challenge other players. Make side bets to see who is the better shooter. Winner takes the pot. You can buy the PDF book on the Billiard Gods website. If you prefer the printed version, you can get the book on Amazon. Please note, the PDF format can be viewed on your smartphone, tablet, and computer. You can study the shots anytime, anywhere. The author has also written these books. The Billiard Gods blog has posts that include excerpts from each of these books. Good luck! Have fun, and shoot straight.